what is up you guys welcome back to my channel this is a very unusual intro i know but i am currently currently trying to keep it a surprise from the boyfriend boyfriend husband whatever you know he's currently in the shower so i don't have too much time to do this but if you are new here my name is eshi and you've probably read the title of this video but i am planning a surprise birthday party for chumley it has literally been months in the making i don't think he has any idea though there have been a couple hints that he may have picked up on. We currently have one of our friends staying here with us. He's actually in town for Chumley's birthday. Chumley has no idea, thinks he's just visiting for fun. But when he was messing around with my phone, I know that one of my chats with this friend was open on my screen and we were explicitly talking about his surprise birthday. So here's hoping he didn't read any of that. <laughs> I'm just so excited to have all of our friends here from Michigan, from California, from kind of all over the US. I'm actually picking a lot of them up from the airport because I feel so bad because they're already flying in all the way to San Diego. I know a lot of friends could not make it, which I totally understand because again, San Diego, very far away. But I'm excited to see if my lies to take the car and pick people up from the airport actually work and if he buys all of it. Honestly, I feel like it's gonna go off without a hitch because Chumley is just so, so oblivious, so ADHD. He barely remembers half the things I say to him. So I think, I think we'll be fine. <laughs> I'm also super excited to just rub it in his face that I've been planning this for so long and he had no idea. <laughs> is that the best part of a surprise birthday party or am I just a terrible person? But he has lots of surprises in store this weekend and he fully deserves it. So I figured I would take you guys along with me. Give this video a like if you love surprise birthday parties like I do and subscribe. I promise I have different content than this typically. Okay, pretty sure time's up for me. So I will talk to you guys later probably still in secret. <laughs> <laughs> Hello again. I just finished picking up the last group of people. I made five trips to the airport. The lies I have been coming up with to sneakily take the car and like leave for half an hour at a time. Oh my god, you guys. At first it was like, oh, I'm going to CVS to pick up a prescription. Came back from CVS. Oh no, they totally didn't have it filled. So I'm gonna have to go back a second time. And then I pulled in some of my friends from San Diego as like an alibi. They were kind of moving at some point. So I was like, oh, I'm gonna pretend like I'm helping you move, okay? That you're my alibi. <laughs> because I had to go to the airport like super late at night and I wasn't sure what other excuse I would have to leave so late. And also I had to pick people up like super early this morning. So that was my alibi for, for two trips. <laughs> Honestly, you guys, I don't think he has any idea. And I know he has no idea because he literally went shopping the other day and like filled up the trunk with crap. So when I was picking people up for the airport, I had to like rearrange at the airport, shove everything in the seats. It was like, <laughs> it was kind of a mess. But the surprise is later today. Originally I was going to rent a boat and have everyone on the boat, us drive him there and like everyone would surprise him on the boat. But that ended up being kind of expensive and he's not like a big boat person. So I changed it because people are gonna be here during the day. I didn't wanna like wait until the very evening for his party to have this surprise. I knew he'd want to spend as much time as possible with his friends. So during the day, we're gonna to go to Balboa Park, which is one of his favorite places here in San Diego, and they're gonna surprise him somehow. I haven't really figured out those specific details. I'm kind of gonna leave it up to them. So yeah, I think next time that I talk to you, I'm probably going to be getting ready to take him to Balboa Park for the actual surprise. Wish me luck, you guys. <laughs> let's, uh, let's go to the left so we can get closer to the tower, I think. Oh, but this is where the duckies go. And the duckies flew over. Yeah. yeah. Water? I mean, very, very rarely, but. There's duckies that be chilling in these ponds at night. But also, like, this is one of my favorite little gardens. It's just pretty. Here's. Whoa! What the fuck? Aiming? Aiming? <laughs> what a dog? I was like, yo, what the fuck is this guy? He was hiding right there. I know! Is that him? Oh my god, dude, what's going Surprise, on? Surprise, buddy! Hey! The shocker told me to, uh, told me to come out here and surprise you. Just oh my god! 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 Oh my
was going oh on? Oh my god. I was like, what the fuck? You're like, am I being attacked? You just so far away. I was trying to figure out how to approach you. Oh my god. I was I expecting was... you guys to come over up there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh my god, he literally like grabbed me and like, what was going through my mind, I'm like, I, I don't know who he's attacking. Like, I don't know what- yeah. Am I gonna die? Yeah, I was like, I don't know what to I had to close a lot of distance before you realized. Yeah, I didn't even know it was you coming through. Yeah, like, <laughs> I saw you there, but I didn't realize you were Yeah. Like, what's up, What's going on? Thanks for coming. Hey, man. Yeah, oh, we'll get you yeah, we can go this way. Yeah. We can, we can uh, do our rounds. Yeah, I walked around like a little bit over here. There's, oh. there's something going on over here. Oh, okay. When did you get into town, my dude? I got, I got in like this morning and last track on. God damn, yeah. seriously. Yeah. Buddy. Yeah. I am very confused. <laughs> in my head is I got in my car today and it was like all it, it's just like the empty light came on. And I was like, that's weird. Like I had over half a tank like three days ago. <laughs> and I've driven my car twice since then, like 20 miles. I'm like <laughs> gotta check the fuel level. Something's going on. You know, just some casual vlogging. Yes, exactly. I don't actually know if I'm going to make this into a video yet, but we'll see. You will have the footage. We'll I, I sure will. You guys, the surprise went off amazingly. He was literally shocked. He kept saying he was so like disoriented and didn't know what was going on. He felt dizzy the entire time, which is kind of hilarious. Don't worry, I made sure to rub it in his face that he had no idea what was going on. <laughs> I was even shocked at what was going on. I didn't even see anybody and they surprised me at the same time as they surprised them because they like came out of nowhere. It was like a flash mob. Tommy was saying that it was like the intro to every 90s sitcom when he kept seeing people come up, they would like turn around. He's like, oh my God, I know you. Oh my God, I know you. What is going on? <laughs> it was hilarious. All credit goes to my friends. I didn't plan any of that part. They did an amazing job. I think I already showed you guys, but Chomi was like slowly realizing all of the lies I've been telling him to go and pick up people from the airport. He was like playing it back in his mind. He was like, oh, so you were lying about going to CVS, huh? And about going to our friend's house and like all these things. And I was like, yep, yep, I was definitely lying. <laughs> so right now I'm gonna go pick up a bunch of stuff for the party tonight. He actually has no idea about that either. That's another part of the surprise. I have booked um, a couple of the rooms here at our building and we're going to host the party there. I also made reservations at a club that he loves afterwards. So other people are gonna join us too. Our LA friends are driving down. There's a couple other San Diego friends that are gonna meet up with us for tonight's party. He has no idea about that. I just told him to get dressed really fancy, so he's in the bathroom doing that. I let it slip after the surprise that we're gonna do Chipotle catering tonight because he loves Chipotle for some reason. I do not get it. 
but I decided to get him Chipotle catering. I also have to go pick up these vegan cupcakes that I'm super excited about from this vegan bakery. I had to pick up balloons. Um, yeah, there's a lot of things to do and not a lot of time, so I need to rush off and do that. Don't know how much of that I'm gonna be able to film, but I will probably catch you as I'm getting ready for the party. Fuck you! 